welcome back guys so this is question number 26 in which we are given different binary numbers and these are the signed binary numbers and we have to determine the decimal equivalent of these numbers okay so as previously discussed these are basically the 8 bit numbers okay so let me have these 8 bit numbers okay so these are all the 8 bit numbers while here this uh, 8 bit is the signed bit okay so whatever here will be if this will be 0 so what is meant by 0 this is a positive number while if it is 1 this it means that that is a negative number so here now let us first use these bits here and see that what are those numbers by converting it to the decimal equivalent so the first number here is this is part a and that is one double zero double one okay double zero and one so these are basically the two rest power zero two one two 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 rest power three 2 raised power 4, 2 raised power 5 and 2 raised power 6 while well, this is a sign bit. So this sign basically represent that this is a negative number okay so this is for the sign while others will be used for the decimal conversion so here that's why it will be 1 multiplied by 2 raised power 0 similarly it will be 0 here it will be 0 as well while this one be will be multiplied with 2 raised power 3 okay this one will be multiplied with 2 raised power 4 okay now these zeros are also multiplied with these uh, terms but uh, the resultant of this multiplication will be zero that's why i have written them here like this okay similarly zero multiplied to the power five is zero and this one will also give me zero okay now adding them what will i get this is one plus zero plus zero plus eight plus sixteen plus zero plus zero okay so how much would it be that is 16 plus 8 is 24 plus 1 is 25 with this one so this is now how much that is 25 while this one is 1 so therefore there this equivalent will be minus 25 in decimal numbers okay so the equivalent of it is minus 25 similarly now converting it into the decimal as well so now we can see that this bit here is zero okay so that's why it would be a positive number similarly is zero one two three four five six okay this six is how much this is 64 plus 32 96 96 uh, plus 12 is 96 plus 12 is how much 96 plus 12 is 8 that is 108 okay 108 plus 4 is how much that is 112 so this is now plus 112 or the decimal equivalent of 0 1 1 1 0 1 0 0 so th that is in decimal so that is in binary so now the decimal or equivalent of it is this plus 1 1 2 in this one okay now uh, solving the last of it which is now c of it is 1 0 and all others are one okay so how much would it be so we can very easily see that this is now one so it basically shows me the negative number okay now as this one is the negative one so all the others except this one are here one one so here it will be one 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 so how much would it be so that is two rest power uh, 5 so that is how much that is so here I will have multiplying all these terms what I will get here I will get 1 plus 2 plus 4 plus 8 okay plus 16 plus 32 okay and that would be in minus so 32 plus uh, 
16 plus 8 plus 4 plus 2 plus 1. So, this is 3 plus 4 is 7, 7, 8 is how much? 7, 8 is 15, 15 plus 16 is 31 and this is minus 63. So, the decimal equivalent of this number is how much? That is minus 63 in decimal. So, that is the procedure in which uh, the sole method or the crucial task is to find that whether the number is negative or positive and all of that basically depends upon these two MSBs, the most significant bits either the, that can be 0 or 1 as well. So, that is it for today in which we have discussed the sign number conversion from binary to the decimal number. So, thank you so much.